Good evening to you as you join us for tonight's live game. Unfortunately, our weather forecast is somewhat less than promising. We're told to expect intermittent spells of heavy rain, which might very well impact on the quality of the football later. It'll certainly add a new dimension, especially for those players who like to keep hold of the ball. A few anxious faces hoping it will all somehow stay away, but I have to tell you that, we are told, is an extremely unlikely scenario. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. Well, there are plenty looking forward to seeing this. A capacity crowd here. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. And we're underway. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Pierre Emmerich Aubameyang, Peter. It's his pace that's his main attribute, especially over those first few yards, where he just seems to glide away from defenders, gets himself into great positions, and likes to hit it hard and nice and early. That's a horrible combination for any defence that's trying to deal with him, I can tell you that. I think the opposition defence agreed too. He's going to be the source of so many of their headaches. And it's Pereira. And here's Perez. Ricardo Pereira. And here's Perez. Perez goes for a sweeping cross. Smith throw. Finds himself eased off the ball. Tierney lobs it in gently. There will be a throw in. Gabriel played back in. Going for goal! Their attempt, just the wrong outcome. Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. <laughs> Only partially clear. Smith throw. And here's Aubameyang. Aubameyang and Aubameyang! Oh, so close to what would have been a memorable goal. He was set on rounding it off in fitting style, but he couldn't make it fit. Well, they would seem to be trying to expose the centre of that defence to, to runners. It makes for some terrific movement. It does, and they may be hit on the break because obviously it requires numbers forward to, to stretch them out. Partey. It's a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Shapes to shoot! Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway.
Leicester take the lead. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Just brushed off the ball there. Smith, throw, unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. He's gone for it! Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. Arsenal really putting a few chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. Tierney. Oh, some tackle that. That is as far as they're going to go. Smith, throw. Partey. The clearance and very necessary. The outcome could so easily have been different. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Oh, that's a waste. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Madison. Oh, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. The referee's awarded a free kick. Strong punch. Shoots! It's off target and by quite a way. Madison, nicely measured pass. Tierney does well there, alert. We hit half time. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Arsenal don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. That intervention was very necessary. What a throw in. Saka. Away from immediate danger. Could be a ghost for goal. Sticks it away. They are right back in business. Lovely goal. Perfect poise to set himself for the strike.
has certainly made things interesting. I oh, look, Peter, I was on the fence before a ball was kicked and uh, I still haven't moved. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. White. Lokonga. And here's Aubameyang. Has a hit! Oh, that is rather wayward. Gabriel. We've had a real complexion change with that equaliser. To get it so early on in this period gives them lots of scope to improve again on, on this score. Has a pop! It's a goal! They've done it! It was coming! They have their reward! Well, you've got to say, the odds on him missing from there were very slim. It's a simple game, a striker's job is to find the space as often as possible, and he did exactly that. Arsenal go into the lead. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Sunchu. Barnes looks to get on the end of this. Good ball over the top. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. Madison. A buccaneering run from the defender. And it's the goalkeepers to claim. Saka. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Out to the left it goes. Barnes. Barnes tore at them and just came up short. Well, he was thinking about headlines, I'm sure, but he ought to focus more on, on breaking lines. And here's Aubameyang. A really good feat from him. There's the delivery, and he just whacks it away, and shoots! And that would have been game, set and match. He got too ahead of himself there, thinking how he could have made things safe. Barty. And the shot! No mistake! Do not write them off, back they come! Bardi with the smoothest one-on-one -on -one finish. He is one very cool customer. Yeah, that's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do. Concentrate on what you have to do. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honour shift. This is quite a battle. Well, the big question now is whether they can keep the energy levels up and try and grab a winner. 
and it's Barnes. Over to the left. Barnes delivers. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Now it's Aubameyang. Now it's Lacazette. Danger averted for now. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Johnny Evans. And it's played forward. Maitland-Niles gets it back. Partey goes looking. Barnes, whose goal scoring skills have already been evident. Forward it goes. Uh, more than happy to take the muscular approach. And there goes the final whistle. A game chock full of moments and talking points. It could have gone either way, but chose in the end to share its spoils. It ends in a highly entertaining draw. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Listen, the more this game went on, a draw was always likely to be on the card. So, overall, I don't think anyone will be complaining too much about what they've got.